Well, hello. Today we're going to be talking real quick about AI and radio and, well, how does that really impact us as engineers? Um, there's been a lot of talk about AI and how how radio is going to respond to it. Uh, there's a company, Futuri, that has got a, a product called Radio uh, uh, um, Radio AI. No, Radio GPT. That's what it is. They have a product called Radio GPT, and it is basically using something to the effect of like Chat GPT to create automated talent, automated DJs, automated you know, music selection. So how do I feel about that? I don't know. <laughs> AI is really interesting. There is a lot of things we can do with it. Um, I guess we're in an early stage right now of trying to figure out where does it fit into the workflow. I'm not gonna get into programming and content and you know, I think I've made my position clear on content and radio and how that all is these days. But how can we as engineers utilize AI and maybe that is something that we could use to our benefit? I know there's products, uh, Adobe has a product um, as part of their podcast service that they are beta testing right now and um, it does miracles with audio. Um, it's still kind of rough. Um, I've used it a few times on some of my videos and it's, it's really interesting to see how AI and how that process of AI uh, can be beneficial to making our jobs easier. Um, there are definitely aspects of AI when it comes down to the IT side of things. Uh, that could be beneficial to helping us secure our facilities. So it's interesting to see. Something like Radio GPT, I'm not too keen on. I still think there is a human element to entertainment that needs to be there. Um, but something like Adobe Podcast, where it's cleaning up the audio. <laughs> You know, it, it's, it's really, it's interesting to see. So anyways, what do you think about AI and how we can utilize it in, in engineering? Um, there is a lot of aspects that we haven't even tapped yet. There's a lot of gatekeeping too. Uh, a lot of engineers who don't want what they do to be known because, you know, that could take away work from them. It's possible, but how can we utilize this technology to make our jobs easier, giving us more time to work on more projects? Anyways, that's my little discussion for this week, and um, yeah. You know, I move from one airport to next to another airport. <laughs> oh well. Thanks for watching, thanks for being a part of this channel, and until next time, We'll see ya.